And they did the woohoo as a married couple. Woo. And now they're going to sleep. <laughs> both of them. They're just both passed out. He needs sleep even more than she does. Why is he not going to bed? Please just go to bed. I know how tired you are. Right, are you having a good cry? Alright. Fine. He's going to go and clean some stuff up. Cool beans. And little kiddo is almost over here. So it's Saturday. Talk about school. We can totally do that. And win a multiplayer game on the video console. Awesome. We can try and do that. Um, I really just can't wait for Rosie to age up into a teen. I'm really excited to see how we uh, incorporate uh, his transformation. But we really need to work on some of these character values because once we get this social skill up to level 10, there's really not much else we really need to do. We could try for his um, aspiration, but I mean, it doesn't do a lot of work for us, does it? I mean, it gives us an extra skill. Would that skill possibly be handy? Being as we need to master the charisma skill, possibly, quite potentially. All right, Rosie, you're actually really hyper right now. So, Thorn, what are you up to? Just hanging out on the computer. I was gonna say it's 1.30 in the morning, otherwise we can actually try and talk to someone. <gasps> Charity aged up, she is a teen now. Which one was your friend? Charity was your friend, right? Dawn was your friend? Oh, I don't remember which one was which. Charity and Dawn are our friends. Except, oh, Dawn is his friend. Okay, let's send a happy text to Dawn. Hopefully she's not mad because it's 2.30 in the morning. It's a Saturday. Technically, it's a Sunday. It shouldn't be too big of an issue. Socialize, let us chat with... Dawn is awake right now. Reached comedy level two. Uh, it's, it is helpful. We can definitely try and attack his uh, aspiration. I tell you one thing, my Disney's Orphanage Challenge... I did it! My Disney's Orphanage Challenge really ruined all of the children's aspirations for me because they were just so awful. Um, so we need to make um, Charity our BFF. Charity totally stole the hair I wanted to have Rosie have as a teen, but that is okay. Alright, you can stop with the mirror and come over here and uh, have a quick meal um, with something different. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. <gasps> we acquired the charisma skill. I forgot we can actually work on that now. We could max out our charisma skill before we're even a teen. Now we're talking. Then we only have to deal with, you know, a couple parts. So we would have to do the politician career and complete the serial romantic aspiration. We need to have one child. Still debating how we're going to do that. Uh, but we need to leave someone at the altar and not it's going to be difficult especially with a serial romantic aspiration and then we'll get married for the first time as an elder and then yeah yellow has lots that they have to work on mastering the astronaut career mastering the rocket science and handiness skill and completing the nerd brain aspiration so we're going to be doing a lot with rosie's kids so the Best thing we can do is get Rosie basically done by the time Rosie has a kid. So, and I don't know how that's going to go yet. I'm still working with the biology of it all. Um, you are getting hungry, though. Can you chatting, power sculpting video? I mean, do what you want to do, kid. It's like 5 a.m. on a Sunday, but if that's what you want to do before you go to bed, more power to you. And Rosario! I can't believe you just broke your dollhouse. And now you're going to go and build something. It's not destroy, build, destroy. I'm actually pretty upset. At least he didn't break the one outside. I forgot that Rosario had two dollhouses. Oh, look at We actually built something. And now you're going to go listen to loud music? No. Not in your parents' bedroom. They're sleeping. We want to win an online multiplayer game, so let's try it. Multiplayer game with... Oh. Online game. 
multiplayer and we will play with uh, Charity. Charity's awake too. This is why the Tilly girls are our best friends. Hello, Tubal's calling. Welcome. I have to apologize for my voice because I've been sick with the flu all week and today I just finally had a voice back. I'm really trying not to have a coughing fit. So if I sound a little weird, you know why. But Jasper needs to come and take care of himself. Use that toilet and take a steamy shower. He wants to be friendly with Addie and make out with her. I thought that table was for toddlers. Um, that's what it says, but I mean, toddlers can't use it. <laughs> um, adults and children, like children and up, have to build something on it, and then I don't know if the toddlers can use it or not. Because I never got that far, Voldemort couldn't build my thing, the, the block thing, fast enough in the toddler challenge. <laughs> Alright, Addy, don't even eat that. Uh, why don't you go for a jog? Go for a jog because you are getting a little round, dear. It's not a bad thing, but I want to make sure you're healthy and staying active. Terra Nova, smiley face, interesting. Yes, on my YouTube channel, I have a uh, seven toddler challenge, but it's Harry Potter themed. And Lord Voldemort was the one adult taking care of my kiddos. So she's out getting her jog on. Thorn is still up chatting with Dawn. That's adorable. And Rosario is still awake playing an online game with, uh, what's her name? Charity. I actually really want to invite her over. Uh, let's do that right now. So Charity, invite to hang out at current lot. She just aged up into a teenager. She's basically our age. Almost. Uh, at the end of a very close match, Rosario just couldn't pull it together for the win. Better luck next time. We have four days until we age up. Notifications are full. Okay, Charity will be right over. Cool beans. Erase them all. Okay, Thorn, you can stop. <laughs> stop laughing at your computer screen. I know you and Dawn are really hitting it off. They're actually, their friendship went up quite a bit. Oh, no wonder, they're both gloomy. That's both adorable and sad. I thought it's from the surname, Terra Nova. Nope, uh, my first name is Tara. So that's why I went with Terra Nova. Oh, you are nasty. Um, Thorn is going to nap. Okay, Rosie, what are you doing? Trying to hug your brother lovingly, even though you're super... He rage quit and broke the controller in half. That's hilarious. Um, Jasper, what are you doing? Jasper, did you just freak out because your wife is now in a mermaid tail in the bathtub? <laughs> um, kid, where's... Oh, Charity's here. She needs a makeover badly. Do you guys think we should give her a makeover? Uh, let's give her a compliment and brighten her day and tell a goofy story and then maybe she'll play a multiplayer game with us. Oh, we're still mad. We're still super, super angry. We probably shouldn't even talk to Charity at all. Um, what can we do to like tone this down? Um, we could do some art. I want to put this on the wall. We're going to put this up here with all the rest of them. Let's just focus on drawing some people right now. Let's draw a picture picture for charity. Are, are, we, are we cool? Are we calm? Are we actually happy now? We're still happy about being a homewrecker. How long does this rage quit last? Three hours? Oh. And he's hot-headed, so that doesn't really help. Let's go ahead and challenge uh, Charity to the Don't Wake the Llama game. Addie, how you feeling? She's actually doing a lot better, so let's go ahead and have... Um, actually, she wants to volunteer with family. We might do that. Um, why don't you come over here and cook some breakfast? Serve breakfast. Uh, let's do pancakes. Because I miss pancakes. All right, you can go ahead and do that so we have some real food in the refrigerator. Because I don't think we have any leftovers in there right now. Yeah, we don't. Oh, we do. <laughs> Oops. Vegetable tempura. When did they do the update to change the color of the quality? I have noticed that tonight, and I have not before. Um, if you write in the journal, it will go, it will go down faster. Oh, that's right. I don't have a journal for him, though. 
I have to buy one. But these two are literally like peas in a pod. I want them to be roommates. So when he is old enough to age up and move out, these two are going to be roommates for a while at least. Um, I, I only want to be friends with her, okay? I don't want to have any kind of uh, serial romantic relationship. Nothing. Are you serious? That evil lady tried to congratulate us on our wedding? Do you know how many times we've frozen her with the freeze ray? Uh, we really want to be mischievous, but also volunteer with the family. We're awful. Uh, let's go ahead and get the mail and just spy on the neighborhood while we wait. Who is this? Who is this? From far away, you look like a hunky sim. Let's investigate. I was not wrong. I mean, the eyes are a little weird, but not a bad looking sim. What is your name? What is your name, Sim? <laughs> I wish we knew who you were. This is Eliza, isn't it? Oh, that's because I turned headline effects off. You guys, you have to tell me these things. Oh, headline effects on. There we go. Who are you? <gasps> Brent Hecking. He is cute. Okay. Rosie, where are you? How are things going? I hope things are going well. I really do want to give her a makeover eventually. I may wait till she's, uh, you know, older though. Thorn, you can't just eat popcorn every day. Please put this in your inventory and then let's go and take care of your needs because you are in need. Use your toilet, take a shower, and then go to bed. This is literally me someday though. Some days, though, I'll stay up until, like, 6 a.m. and then just feel like crap and be struggling all the next day. It's really ridiculous. Addy, how are things going in here with your little mischievous butt? All right. I mean, they're, they're going, I guess. Let's check her skills. Logic is now at level 38 and mischief is 9. I wish using the observatory to spy on people raised both the logic and the mischief skill but unfortunately it does not uh, why don't you stop and then come over here and have some of these pancakes grab a serving i really need all of this stuff to get cleared up and put away <laughs> what are you doing you can't just go to bed you have a friend waiting to play a game with you you're literally in the middle of challenging her and you still won when you're sleeping Charity, you are awful at this game. My goodness. I'm a little embarrassed about it. Um, Addy, how are things going with your pancakes? They look really good. Except she can't even eat at the table because it's just full of this nasty popcorn. I'm going to get rid of this thing. I'm so ready to get rid of this thing. Um, and the tea is really bad and spoiled. And now you're like super spotty sick. Please go and fix this. Repair. Repair, repair. Um, you are still sleeping, I guess. Fine, whatever. Your friend is gonna leave, though. Hey, is this the hottie guy? No. <laughs> it's Don Lothario. <laughs> My bad. Uh, what did we get in the mail? We have too much stuff. Ooh! We got It's All Elementary. Let's go ahead and put this down here as proof that we finished this collection. Sweet. Put it right there. Um, Ayaka is wondering if I want to go to her house. No, Ayaka. I do not want to hang out with you. I don't like you. Um, we also got a new prince. And we got our festival sparkler that I forgot to light. Can I put this anywhere down here? No. Okay, hold on, hold on. I have plans for that. I just want to see what I can do with these prints. Oh, we got four of them. And it looks like... Mm, one of them is new. We got this one. We'll put that right there. And the rest are repeats. So we'll just sell them. I do not have a need for repeat prints. We'll just sell them all. And then let's go upstairs again. Where is our computer desk? Actually, where is our bedroom? Here we go. Here we go. We have all of this space up here. Let's see if we can put some of this stuff up here. Where else can it go? Just random places. I want to put this one right here because that reminds me of the wedding nights. Can we put the sparkler down anywhere? No. Okay. All right. That's good enough. 100% okay with whatever it's at. Um, she's like perfectly happy right now and super playful though. 
Stop playing video games. You're too playful. Um, we could go and oh, I don't want to play a game though. We could go and just play chess. <gasps> Can Rosie and the girl live together and breed small fluffy puppies? Yes. We'll give them both small fluffy puppies. No, can you get off the computer, honey? Um, I actually want you to just like sit here. I wanted Addie to use the computer. Does she have one downstairs? I don't remember if I put one in her lab. No, she does not because we don't have room for it. I want you to go over here and troll the forums. Anything we can do to be mischievous. Um, socialize. No. Web. Which would be, trolling the forums is mischievous, Can it, is it not? So, yeah, we'll, we'll just let her do that for now. What are you doing? Can you um, load the dishwasher, please? Because we literally just have filth sitting everywhere. Uh, Rosie, you're finally awake. Let's put the walls down. That was an issue. What are you, what are you doing? Challenge. <gasps> Not smart enough. I've been trying to do homework for school, but these last few assignments have felt really hard. Maybe I'm not smart enough to do it. What do you think? Spend more time. Practice makes perfect. Um, that affects responsibility. And focus on different top topics. This affects conflict resolution. Um, They're both good pieces of advice. I know that Rosie really needs to work on conflict resolution. Um, but also I just want to tell him to spend more time. Practice makes perfect because I think that having poor conflict resolution and, uh, emotional control are going to be very fitting to his personality. So more responsibility, um, emotional control decreases. Yup. That about sums it up. Yep. So manners and responsibility are the best. Empathy is kind of neutral. Um, are you going to go and challenge her again? Why don't you come over here and use this? Addie, who's calling you now? Congratulations on getting married to Jasper. Ayaka, leave us alone. Should invite her over and just be mischievous to her. We have been mischievous. Can we continue to be mischievous, please? More choices. Socialize. We're getting kisses. Troll those forums. All right, you are sick. Stop kissing her. You're just going to get her sick now, too. I will put the pancakes away. Um, did we did we even clear out the... We did. Let's brew a different pot of coffee. Let's do the calming chamomile. That is what I would go for. So, Rosie, what you doing? She's not even here anymore, honey. Oh, why don't you just come over here and practice speech? Just keep working on that charisma skill. And then we'll talk about school to someone. Uh, Thorn is still sleeping. Oh my gosh. He's not going to be a happy camper. Why don't you get up and have some food? Just come over here. Grab the leftovers. And we broke it. <laughs> I can't trust you to make anything, Jasper. You're supposed to be our cook. And you broke the coffee tea maker thingy. Alright, what's your skill at? Charisma is at level one. He's got a broken skill on top of him. Perfect. Addy, how about you? How's it going? Oh, it just takes forever to raise their skills once they're already at level nine. All right. Well, you eat your pancakes. Uh, do you have any school projects? No, just your homework. Which you didn't even finish. Why are you so tense? Needs amusement. Well, when you're done, you can come over here and watch TV or something. Play a game. Um, why don't you play some My Sims Racing? Addie is going to go and mop. I don't think that helps. I, I mean, I guess it helps a little. Jasper couldn't finish mopping because I made him fix the coffee tea thingy. It's a teapot. It's a tea brewer thingy. I know that. Um, Jasper obtained some parts from fixing the thing. Upgrade. I can't do it. Um, got some poor quality chamomile tea and it's brewing. Awesome. He's gonna go diving. Uh, we want to level up in the mischief skill. Alright. Well, what can we do that's mischievous? Let's invite someone over. Let's just invite someone over. Um, should we pick a new one? Let's be mean to Cassandra. 
just trickle-down effect from her mom. Or we could invite Jesminder over. Or Paolo. Let's invite over Neil. Yeah! Let's invite Neil to come over, and we'll just be so mischievous with him. He hates us. We should invite Vlad over to make him our mortal enemy again. Alright. Thorn, you are finally awake. Going to do your homework while watching TV. That's very productive of you. Neil will be right over. He's just like, yes, finally. She's giving me the time of day. Alright, I'm going to have to um, reset him because he's glitching out. Alright, he was stuck in a challenge with her. So, How is our motor skill going up? We're literally like... Practice your speech, please. How is your motor skill going up right now? You're speaking. I'm confused. But you're almost at level 2 for the charisma skill, so that's a plus side. Um, is our, our guest here yet? He is at level 2 of the charisma. Awesome. So let's... Um, let's uh, do a knock-knock joke. And then let's go ahead and uh, see where that leads us. <laughs> um, Thorn has reached video gaming level too, so that's pretty neat. Um, let's not try to cheer him up. Instead, let's um, trash. He thinks it's nasty in here. I know it is. Let's be mischievous. Let's lie about our career and not tell him that. Lock household for... Lock for everyone. Everyone but household members. I just don't want him to leave if he gets mad. I'm determined to complete our mischief skill by being mean to Neil and ruining our relationship with him. But let's just be a little a little rude. Um, let's instill him with false confidence and be like, yeah, no, dude. You can reach our skill level at work too. You just have to try. So Neil works with us as a scientist. He's a fellow scientist. Um, let's uh, describe the apocalypse to him because we know it's coming. We are scientists. Um, let's uh, let's give him some fake bad news. Be like, dude, the apocalypse I'm describing is real and it's happening. And then just do the spot thing. And this, then then we can just unleash everything and start being plain rude. We'll trick him with the hand buzzer. We're going to start a preposterous rumor. And uh, what else can we do? Claim to be a criminal mastermind. Pretend to be slapped. Share a conspiracy theory. And then we will first pretend to be... No, where did it go? <laughs> that was funny. Uh, we'll we'll uh, slap him silly. And then what else can we do? I mean, there's so only so many we can do. Um, claim to be a criminal mastermind. And then uh, let's dare him to streak. So right now, he's feeling super confident. So us instilling him with false confidence actually instilled him with real confidence. Awesome. Hey, I heard you became friends with Dawn Cook. She's pretty cool. I don't know who you are, but you have very large blue eyes. Your face is kind of shriveled up together, and it's slightly off-putting. But yeah, I forgot. Donna's our friend. Let's chat with her. We'll, we'll, we'll do a little chat. Just a little baby chat. Is he super upset now? <laughs> Where did he go? No, Neil, come back. How did he leave? I didn't lock all the doors, did I? No, don't leave. Call over. Don't let him leave your sights. We will now unlock this door. Get your butt back over. Oh, he's actually streaking. I forgot I told him to do that. Look at that. His pink little butt is hanging out in the open. Oh my gosh. This is the perfect thing ever. Neil. We are the one that got away. We can influence you to go streaking out in the middle of the daylight hours on Sunday. I'm impressed. Except now he's leaving. And now he left. And now he's gone. And our mischief skill is... Oh, at least it's up to 39%. Hopefully he comes back. Uh, maybe I can convince him to come and play chess with us. 
play with Neil. I guess he's still a guest here. All right. How are you doing? You're still playing online? Okay. Not doing homework. Um, not calling Dawn. Just, just playing this online game. Oh, he got gold! Way to go. Nicely decorated. Very proud of him. Rosie, how are things going? Ooh, you were hungry. You gotta say something. Uh, you can't just sit there. Get leftovers, please. And then you should probably check and see if you have homework. Do your homework because it's Sunday night at 6 p.m. Um, are you just stinky or is the food stinky? Please load that dishwasher because that is disgusting. Um, Addy, how are things going? Oh, he finally came back and he put his clothing on. Nice. Let's go ahead and be mischievous while we're sitting here. Noxious cloud. I don't know if we can multitask like this, but invite to a fake party. Oh, we can instill him with more false confidence now that he's energized from his streaky little run. Um, describe the apocalypse. Oh my gosh, we got him. We tricked him. Lie about our career again. And I cannot believe our friendship is not changing. Share a conspiracy theory. Mischievous. And uh, start a preposterous rumor. And then just keep doing that chess thing. So uh, mischief is actually going up 46%. Chess is still at 41%. So they're both going up fairly evenly. I mean, I feel like if we tried a little bit harder, we probably could have actually um, gotten them both done before the end of the day today. But I do want to send her to work on Monday. I really am I'm really going to try to do that. Because she can also just work on them both at work. She can work on both skills and also just get more money and not have to eat up all of her vacation days even though she has nine because i mean the both of the boys are going to be at work what did you do jasper before you had spots and now you have stripes you can't just be switching up on me like that you have to pick one or the other and i'm making the new stuff for sims 4 what are you doing i'm making the new stuff for sims 4 which new stuff what new stuff? I'm, I'm confused. I'm very confused. Um, Tubal's calling. What new things are you making for The Sims 4? Alright, Thorn, how are you? You're still- no, stop it. Stop it, you finished your online game. You finished. I know what you're doing. You're trying to trick me. Addy, is he leaving? Goodbye. Fine, goodbye. Just leave then. She needs to go to bed soon anyways. Uh, why don't you come over here and help the kiddo with his homework? We haven't hardly talked to the kids all day. Okay, you are laughing hysterically. Why don't you come over here and get some medicine for yourself since we got some for the kiddos? And uh, actually, uh, don't place it in the world. Don't place it in the world. Just take it. Drink it. Okay. And he left. Um, do you make CC? I make the little robots as the decor for collection, uh, like the minifigures from the Capsules of Time, and its second functionality will be Toys for Kids. I made two already, and third is near to be ready. That is really cool! I would love to showcase that in a kids-themed uh, CC uh, video, if you were ever interested in sharing the links. Um, look who is finally up and around. No, you're not going to watch comedy show. Kid, you are exhausted. Go to sleep. Addie, how are things going? She would be in here. I thought I told you to come and eat. Um, get leftovers, please. Um, what are you doing, Jasper? You are eating pancakes like a good kid. Rosie, can you please get up? All right, I really wanted you to come over here and play with this thing. Um, play doctor. I think it helps with empathy or something like that. Um, it would be really nice if uh, we could work on this a little bit more. This conflict resolution is so bad. All right, when you are done, please set the table with a fancy setting. We are going to do the border one. 
All right. Oh, his empathy is going up. So, I mean, his empathy can... Ah, his empathy should probably be really bad. I don't know. He's going to be a serial romantic one day. I don't know. How long does this phase last? And what skill are you gaining? Mental and motor skill? His motor skill is not going up. He's just gaining mental. He's really close to getting to level 4 of the uh, motor skill, though. So, that's pretty neat. All right, he's going to go set the table, and then you should probably go to bed, my kiddo. Addie is going to bed because she does work in the morning. Jasper, please. I, I don't know. What can you do for me? <laughs> Does anything need to be cleaned? All right, you are free. You can come to bed, too. It looks like everyone is off to sleep, so tomorrow... Rosie, go to bed. Go to sleep. Who are you, and why are you here? No! 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 Get up! There's a vampire at the door! Never fails! Every single time I record and play this game, there's a vampire at the door! I feel like conflict resolution would be useful for a politician. That is true. Um, please just go freeze her butt before she tries to suck our blood. No, she's like, no, no, not again! <laughs> All right, Addie, you can come on back to bed. So I found out if you uh, freeze the vampires when they come to visit before they get through the door, then it basically just stops them in their tracks and they can't suck your blood. And when they unthaw in the morning, they run away from the sun. Hmm. So that's really fun. I feel like someone should update the um the not so berry rules would be really fun if they were updated with all of the new things like vampires and uh the new skeletons with the adventure pack and also with the pets i think that would be a lot of fun one of my characters is a scientist i created the poison which increases the needs into max and created the machine for clone objects now i clone the poisons drink and sell <laughs> nice so i always have money always have all needs on maximum and it's not cheat very nice we have the cloning thing in the basement i've been cloning these things for more money <laughs> because they're worth quite a bit i mean oh maybe they're not i was cloning these to try and complete the elements collection because these are the things that um the last two elements we needed came from but i think i saw our ghost <laughs> oh she thought out there he is jay you're alive kind of in a wake and you're, you're dripping jay we killed jay um we killed jay like first second stream we killed him right away and we keep his ghost around he hangs out and he like watches our kids and breaks our stuff and drips all over my house I'm so minorly upset about it. Oh, we're just gonna watch Jay. He uh, emptied out all the dirty things from our, our refrigerator. Um, he broke our shower. I'm a little ticked off about that. Whatever. What are you gonna do now? Don't you dare break our tea maker. Now he's like messing with our TV. No, he's actually watching it. I'm just speeding up too fast. <gasps> Look at the beautiful Sims 3 graphics. I'm actually minorly up I'm, I'm still really really upset that sims 3 wasn't working and cooperating with me tonight i really wanted to play some 100 baby challenge in that but you know what we never light our fire pit why do we even have it a really cool streamer named gitsy made a legacy challenge similar to not so berry that incorporates pets i can send it to you if you want i would love that all right jasper why you up Still on that happy high from being married. Um, let's read note. And then actually try and repair some of this stuff. Because it doesn't help if we mop up the puddle if we don't fix what's breaking anyways. I like the border ones. They're very simple, very pretty. <gasps> Look who is awake. It is 5.30 in the morning and she is up and ready for this day. She works in five hours though. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, oh look at Jay broke the, the shower and made the puddle, but he's helping us clean it up. 
So even though he breaks things like a ghost does because he's a little unsettled that we killed him, um, he definitely is a helper around the house. So let's just make sure all of her needs are tip top. Let's take a, uh, a bath with, ooh, muscle relaxing soak. Let's do that. Who doesn't want a beautiful relaxing soak bath in the morning? First thing, I mean, I definitely do. Uh, we'll go ahead and have, uh, we'll just have a quick meal. Actually, we'll have some leftovers. And then we'll make ourselves a sack lunch, because why not? I want you to go ahead and mop up that puddle while you're at it. And then you can pee. I mean, you guys are married. I think you can handle that much. And then cook a gourmet meal, because why not? Uh, let's do some pasta primavera, because it's vegetarian safe for um, Adelaide. Um, we'll just speed through this. Thorn is awake, and the sink down here is broken too. Awesome. Well, since you're down here, you might as well use that shower. And, uh, you have a little bit of time before school, so why don't you do a pop art painting? Because that is what, uh, we all that has been painting. And he has been posting pictures of everything on Twitter, so that's, that's what I feel like doing. <gasps> Kiddo needs some help. Okay. Oh, all right, mom is still in the bathtub. Okay. Mm Are you almost done, Addie? Okay, she is. Come on, run your little britches over here and use this and use this. And then you should probably... Why is... No, you're not sleeping. Shower and use the toilet. And then come over here and have some breakfast. Have some cereal or something. Oh, look at We've got our pasta primavera. All right, Addie, when you are done eating... Please pack up a, pick a serving. What are you doing? Why are you stuck on this bed thing? Oh my gosh. Rosario, why are you the one glitching out today? You are the one that should never be glitching out. You are the one I need to be, you know, perfect and pristine and to carry on this challenge. Um, a really cool, okay, yes, I, I read that. I just want to make sure I don't miss any comments because I'm very bad at checking them sometimes. All right, Addie. Today we're going to max out your skills and just be done with you. But I love you, but we're going to be done with you. I did get some new Max's Match hair. I want to see if I can find something that will better suit her that's Max's Match and Teal. Uh, like a mint color. So that's definitely something I want to look at. We're going to give her one final makeover um, after, or before we move Rosario out, but by then I think she'll be, um, I think she'll be an elder by then anyway. She has 15 days, Rosie has three, but then he has to go through the entire teenage years as well, so we will see. What are you doing? What did you do with that serving that I told you to pick up? Oh, there it is. Um, please pack into a sack lunch so it doesn't go bad quite as quickly. Yes. Alright, put that in your pocket. No. Put in inventory. Alright, how much time do we got on this ticking bomb? Um, nine hours. Hopefully we'll remember to eat it before we go to work. <laughs> and we actually work in two hours now, so let's uh, have some quality time with our hubby. He wants to be friendly with us and make out with us. Two things he hasn't been able to do since actually we got married. I sent it to you on Twitter. Thank you, Vandy Squirrel. Um, let's also caress her cheek. And uh, let's do something romantic. Um, let's kiss. Well, we'll just do the kiss. Rosario is headed off to school. And then let's sit and chat here. And it looks like Thorn is off to school as well. He's feeling very inspired take a look. Ooh, I'm liking this. It's poor quality, but I still like it. We're going to frame it. We're going to let him keep it. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, testing cheats, move objects. Oh my gosh. Programming my keyboard keys has been the most amazing thing I've ever done. Uh, let's do the making out thing that he wants to do so badly. Maybe. There it is. Anyway, find it. He also just wants to be friendly. I thought we were being friendly. And now he wants to flirt with her. 
There we go. All right, nothing like a little good morning um, flirtation to uh, start your day off the right way. Uh, we also want to be friendly, which I've been trying to do, but I, I don't really know how to do. Friendly, I thought I was being friendly before when I asked her about her day or brightened her day, whatever. Whichever one I did, uh, let's do just something I can do while sitting here. Um, we'll just ask her about her day. He really wants to prepare pancakes again. So why don't you come on over here, man, and serve breakfast? We'll do pancakes again. All right, Addie is feeling all kinds of flirtatious time bomb right now. And she really wants to level up her mischief skill and volunteer as a family. Um... Might have to wait till the next weekend to do the volunteer thing. She wants to kiss her husband, but she has to go to work very soon. Uh, let's ponder moves. Hopefully we can switch over to a focused mood by the time we get to work, because that's what we need when we go to work. Oh, who's calling you? Uh, bathroom sandwich. What? <sighs> Why are our kids so weird? Uh, we found Thorn in a bathroom stall today eating a sandwich. This is unexpected, and we're not sure of what to make of it, uh, but figured we should call. That's just wrong, which affects manners, and when you're hungry, you need to go. Affects empathy. Um, I've totally, like, finished the last bite of a piece of candy while walking and sitting down in the bathroom. So, I mean, when you're hungry and you need to go... <laughs> Manners have decreased, but empathy increases. All right, don't judge me. Um, Ada friend. Thorne's friend hasn't studied for the big exam today. Since he's taking it earlier in the day, Thorne could easily remember the questions and slip his friend the answers. He's going to do it. Should he do it? No. His friend should be, you know, responsible for not studying. But Thorne has a lot of issues right now where, you know, ever since his brother was born, his parents don't give him the same attention at all, really, and don't really share the affection that they give to Rosario. So I think Thorne is the type of person that is, you know, trying to look for approval from anywhere he can get it. So share the answers. Hopefully this guy stays a friend. Um, all it takes is a few answers to make sure that Thorne's friend passes. Now his friend owes him a gigantic favor and not a bad position to be in. And he actually gains something. So let's go ahead and join Adelaide as she goes to work. Um, we are very closely getting into the last few days that we will be accompanying her to the lab. So it's kind of scary and kind of exciting all at the same time. Um, don't mind me. Just um, checking Facebook notifications. Okay, nothing big. Daily experimentation. I was really hoping for a sixum party. Uh, welcome to Future Sim Labs. You'll be busy uh, conduct, uh, conduct, conducting, conducting essential experiments. All right. So let's take a look at Addie in her mad scientist garb. We gotta get a, a nice little, a nice little screenshot of our girl. All right, this is gonna be a you know, potential new thumbnail. I like this way better, but whatever. Ah! She just ran right through us. All right, let's pause, um, because I see all of this stuff right here, and we can just collect it and sell it. Um, upgrade the electro flux wormhole generator to travel to an alien world. <gasps> Are we getting really close to being able to travel? I hope so. So for those of you who haven't seen this far in a stream before, um, I totally took over this lab and I locked this door so only Addie can go in it and this is her own private lab and this is where we work. <laughs> so let's go ahead and I can't. Oh, I need to bring it to the... I see. I need to bring it here. So now let's us upgrade the wormhole generator. So we'll keep working on that. Hopefully we'll be able to travel to Sixum very soon now since we can travel through there. We'll have to bring the one that we have at home back and upgrade that as well. And it looks like we have these two cubes that I don't know what they are. Items in a stack. We'll sell them because I don't know what they are actually. I think it's a glitch. No, those are the failed cloning items. Okay. I understand now. 
I do, I do, I do. And we only have six hours left on this food, so hopefully we don't get hungry anytime soon. I'd really like her to work out today, though, and just be mischievous to her coworkers and work on her logic skill. That's literally all I want her to do is just skill build at work and hopefully work towards being able to uh, travel through the wormhole eventually. Um, but look at this. We're at level 7 of the parenting skill already. That's pretty neat. I'm really proud of that. Who do we have at work today? Pranav is still working with us. Uh, Trinity Hughes is our receptionist on the back computer. Uh, we have Don, who's here. Neil, our friendship just went up with him. <sighs> ja, 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 ja. I like uh, Lucky Sims. Uh, you're very beautiful. Thank you. Uh, we oh, oh my gosh, we upgraded the Electro Flux wormhole generator. All right, we can now travel to an alien world. Which is sweet. I just want to put this back where I had it. Cool beans. Alright. Uh, mind control, mind control, mind control. I don't really want to do that stuff. But uh, we probably should. Don't go observe the sky. Please come over here and let us mind control you to change outfits. More choices. Mind control. Please change outfit into your swimwear. And you as well. Anyone who's already sitting is getting changed clothing instructions. You are going to be... Don, we know you. Mind control to go sit. And Neil, please change clothing. Mind control to change into your athletic wear. There's gotta be more sims over here. Um, mind control to sit. So Chloe is lab tech, but she's on the receptionist computer. And Trinity is a receptionist, but she's at the lab tech computer. Uh, I'm very confused. All right, she's also an alien. She's 100% an alien. Um, is this our backup one? Okay. So we're just gonna mind control everyone. Yes, she's totally an alien. Uh, let's go ahead and oh, we'll just ignore them. You mind control him to sit when you're done. Mind control to sit your booty. We're just gonna double, uh, double speed through this. I can't believe it's already noon. What? Hopefully getting these two done is a, a pretty quick fix. We'll just tell people to change and we'll tell people to sit. It's, it's not gonna be a big deal. Except now he's in the bathroom. Okay, <gasps> we have some things that are ready. We need to mind control someone to garden. Uh, Neil. Um, order co-worker. We don't have to mind control. We can order him to garden and take care of that for us. Because I don't want to. Upgrade Simray with Transform Sim. Yes! I've never done that one before. Alright, we still need one more to sit, though. Um, pause, because we're wasting time. Uh, mind control to sit, please. We need you to do this right away so that I can upgrade your sim race, sweetheart. Please get a move on. Alright. That'll work. Let's grab our sim ray in here. The one that we named Berry Blaster. And we will upgrade sim ray with Mind Control Panic and Transform Sim. I didn't know we had two options available. Let's do both. Um, have her eat her lunch before it goes off. Um, good idea. Most of the time it goes bad because her hunger is not usually bad enough, but might as well, um, unpack her school lunch. Um, school is out for the day. Awesome. Grades are up. Upgraded Simray. Um, did we, did we get our lunch out? Are we going to sit and eat it now before it goes bad? Hopefully. Hopefully, and then when we're done, we can come down here. We have done satisfactory work enough. I am not worried about it. My Fitbit is yelling at me to get ready for bed. We didn't even eat it. Stop. You have 48 minutes. Come and eat your pasta. Your husband made this for you with the love and tenderness in his heart, and you're going to eat it. It looks really good. I really want some pasta. Really, really could use some pasta right about now. 
being sick all week with the flu has just been awful because I've had nothing but like soup and popsicles because my throat has been so awful. All right, our husband is super, super flirtatious right now. So we have eaten enough. At least our hunger is not a, an issue. So that's nice. We'll finish upgrading this thing. I want one of these at home. All right, we'll put that in our inventory now when we're done. Thank you for the subscription. Um, I don't know how to pronounce your name. If you can put it phonetically in the chat, that would be awesome. Thank you so much. Did I finish this? this? All right, let's, let's pause for two moments here. We have an hour left of work. Our skills, where are we at? Where are we at? Logic is a little lower, 47. Mischief is at 55. So let's see what we can do. Mind control. Where, where is it? Why isn't that niche? Why is it not there? Did I not finish upgrading it? Really? Expert repair. Oh, I broke this thing. That's why. Oh my goodness. Okay. Breach tanning is level two. We have to fix this thing. The mass spectrometer thing. No, what is it even called? The invention constructor. I'm thinking about but the show. The, the, not the show. The, the mass spectrometer is the other actual piece of equipment that spins around in circles with uh, little samples and it like separates things with gravitational pull and all that stuff. I don't even know. I don't even know how to listen to me. Um, I just need you to fix this before we end up having to stay late. All right, come on. Come on, are we done? We're good? <gasps> yes, continue with the mind control panic. I wanna see this in action. I just wanna bring this home so we can do it at home. Oh, we're so close to being done. If we get down to five minutes, I'm extending it. Eight, seven, six, five, oh my gosh, four, three, two, pause. Upgraded Simray! <laughs> we have one minute left of work. Addy upgraded the Simray, uh, so can mind control Sims to panic those ready, who's ready to freak out. We're taking the berry blaster with us and we're having some mischief at home. Yes, 2,223 simoleons plus another vacation day. We have 10 vacation days now. I don't know what to do with them all because we literally spent a vacation day every time we were home with the toddler. Uh, so that's a little frustrating. Like, I don't know what to do with all of that, but that's okay. Um, we actually ate our lunch today, and we made some progress at work. Got to do a bunch of mind control. We didn't really do... A, we, we upgraded our portal, so we can bring our portal to work with us tomorrow as well. So let's uh, just uh, take a moment and uh, get the mail. I'm hideous. All right, hold on. Thorn is having a moment. Uh, my face is a mess. I can't go anywhere looking like this. What can I do? It's fine. Don't overreact or try some light makeup. Um, see, okay. I feel like the answer to this is going to depend on which child I'm talking to. Because if it was Rosario, I'd say try some light makeup. But since it's Thorn and I can't be bothered, I'm going to say it's fine. Don't overreact. Oh my goodness, I feel so bad for this kid. Bills have arrived. What? 4,000 simoleons. All right, get the mail when you're done, please. Uh, we're probably going to need to head downstairs and uh, go for uh, an endurance run. Oh, they want us to join Party House. Like, what made them think we wanted to join Party House? Uh, we'll go ahead and grab this and put that in our inventory. And then let's, uh, let's see what we have that's worth money right now. I don't think we have a lot. Ayaka, leave me alone. I really don't want her to bother us. That's okay. Do I have anything in here that's worth a lot of money? I don't think so. I really, I mean, I could actually... Oh, I don't have these enough to where I can just sell them, don't I? I can't sell them to the Simsonian. 
I keep thinking I'm in um, Animal Crossing. Uh, but which one of these is worth the most? 20, 30, the ruby is. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and clone the object a couple times and see if we can get anything out of that. Um, honey, what are you doing? <laughs> Just hanging out playing dolls. All right, challenge someone to don't wake the llama. Definitely happening. Uh, Rosie, what are you up to? Peeing. Good call. Kiddo, do you have homework? We need to make sure you at least finish school. Have Ayaka join Jay. That'd be funny. All right, so we had pancakes that were only half made on the counter. <laughs> Wonderful. Um, Jasper, can you actually just come back over here and resume pancakes? Was that Thorn? What are you doing now? I really liked the painting you did earlier. I wish you would do another one. It's only 8 p.m. Why don't you do one more pop art painting? Do a, a smaller one this time. And you somehow lost your homework somewhere, so that's great. I have zero idea where it is. Great. Is it in the bookshelf? Uh, open. If it's in here, I'm gonna be mad. It's not! I'm even more mad! Okay, whatever. No homework for him. Whatever. Jasper. How are, how are the, the pancakes? Are you still working on those? Alright, you are still working on your homework. Addie, how's the endurance run going? She's having a lot of uh, quality me time today. <laughs> And we still need to... <gasps> you meant have her join Jay. <laughs> I like the way you think. All right. Um, we're definitely definitely going to have to have Ayaka visit and uh, potentially have a repeat of the pool disaster. All right. Very excited. Um, listen to loud music. No, kiddo. You can't. Not allowed. You need to uh, get some sleep or something. Your charisma skill is only level two. Um, why don't you uh, practice your speech for a little bit and then go off to bed. All right. Jasper, you finished your uh, food. Take a cold shower and then come to bed. Actually, pee first and then come to bed. He's such a good stay-at-home dad. Like, we would so be lost without him. All right, Vandy Squirrel, I get I get it. I get it. We will have her join uh, Jay. So this endurance run thing is taking forever, but at least she can watch TV while she does it, which is the whole point. That's why I put the TV on the wall, because it's definitely something I would do on a treadmill. Um, civic public access. That's not what I would watch, though. Whatever. At least her entertainment is going up while her fitness is going up. I should just bring everything to the lab and see what else I can update right now. Upgrade right now. You know, we've got the, the teleportation portal. Um, upgrade. Upgrade. We can upgrade the satellite dish. Um, two of you is all... Oh, we can... Okay, I see what we can do. Wait, yeah, we'll just put that on there for now. We can upgrade that as well. So reached fitness level five. Sweetie, that is enough of an endurance run for you now. Please clone this object. Please work. Please work. Why are you so tense and insecure? All right, we failed. All right, we'll sell that. Try cloning the object again. Did I do it on the wrong side? Do I have to do it like this? No, okay. Clone that object. I know it doesn't work every time, but it'd be really fun to clone a sim. <laughs> All right, if this fails every time, I'm just gonna give up, okay. Yeah, we're gonna sell that thing, it's just a block. Okay, we'll take this with us. We will upgrade all of those when we go to work tomorrow. But uh, yeah, girl, I think it's time for you to go to bed. Rosie, how are you feeling? You're not going to cry over it. You broke it. All right, you should probably actually just... No, okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Cry it out. He's working through his emotions right now, okay? Broke his own dollhouse, but now he, now he noticed it, and he, he's feeling a little bit re remorse about it. Maybe that'll help his emotional control go up. 
There's conflict resolution. Oh my gosh, he ages up in three days and we have another teenager in the house. I'm not mentally ready. At least they'll only both be teenagers for one day. And then, uh, then Thorn will age up. No, kid, stop. Get out of bed and go to bed properly, please. Just go to bed properly. 